This is a special KMIR presentation of the Agua Caliente 4th of July Fireworks Show. Live from Agua Caliente Casino Resort Spa. First on KMIR tonight, friends and family of slain teenager are mourning, holding a vigil tonight at Panorama Park in Cathedral City. He was so positive, always dancing, always so happy. <laughs> Just a positive vibe to be around, and uh, I don't understand why someone would want to do this. Lisa Nieder didn't even give it a second thought, getting behind the wheel while high on drugs. Jacob Lerma has been fighting for a better life since he was a little kid. When it comes to boxing, I got to do four rounds of jump rope. And then after the jump rope, I got to go in the ring, shadow box for four rounds. Then after that, I go to the back for eight rounds. Then after the back, I go to the speed back for four rounds. The list goes on, and when Jacob's not training, he's helping his father maintain the club. A doctor at Desert Regional Medical Center says the number of pedestrians and bicyclists admitted for automobile accidents has increased nearly 60%, and that's just in the last four years. Three men and a team sent to the hospital. A fight over a burglary that turned into a gunfight. Good evening, Gino. This structure fire started around 2 o'clock this afternoon on the 80,000th block of Avenue 43. Firefighters say it all started from this trailer you see behind me. Take a look. Everything in this backyard is charred. Look how it just crumbled, this trailer, almost like a soda can. And then those flames quickly jumped to two nearby residences. You can see the damage on this next door property. Firefighters say they didn't have to rescue anybody, but we did speak to two neighbors who were saying that they heard the woman who was living inside the trailer just screaming for help. Fortunately, they were able to help rescue her and get her out. Thank you. 